to the mysterious death of an American celebrating his first wedding anniversary in Mexico. He died after falling from a balcony at a resort. Authorities say it was an accident. His family believes he was the victim of a brutal crime. Janae Norman is here with that story for us. Good morning, Janae. Guys, good morning. Elliot Blair's family says they are reeling from his death that they don't believe was an accident. And for context, this is a family of attorneys. They say they have extensive legal training in criminal law, and they believe he was the victim of a brutal crime. His wife saying she's been given multiple versions of what happened to her husband. This morning, the family of an American public defender who died while celebrating his first wedding anniversary at a Mexican resort is demanding answers, saying they believe he was the victim of a crime. Elliot Blair and Kimberly Williams staying at Las Rocas Resort and Spa last weekend, which advertises its property online as the best choice south of the border, located 15 minutes south of Tijuana. Authorities confirming the day before the couple's anniversary, Blair was found dead from an apparent fall from a third floor balcony. An autopsy by Mexican officials ruling the fall caused his death, calling the tragedy an unfortunate accident. But earlier that day, a local law enforcement official pointing to a specific injury on Blair's forehead, telling ABC News the wound would not have been caused by a fall. Now, Blair's wife, who's also a public defender, hiring a private investigator, telling ABC News, based on their initial investigation, Elliot was the victim of a brutal crime. She goes on to say the incident did not occur off their room's private balcony, nor any balcony, but instead in an open-air walkway outside the front door of their room, and that her husband was found in his underwear, his sleeping T-shirt and socks. The Mexican authorities are currently investigating the case and they've released almost no information at all. This is also uh, a very dangerous part of the world. It's important that everybody just keep an open mind and hopefully the, uh, the Mexican authorities will have more information for us. The U.S. State Department confirming they are aware of the death and stand ready to provide assistance. As family and friends now search for answers, Blair is being remembered as a zealous advocate for justice. He was such a wonderful human being and such a compassionate, caring, competent attorney his diligence but what and his courtroom demeanor was fantastic so he just i really saw excellent young attorney who fought hard for his clients and gave them their best ethical defense and the family calling Blair a brilliant attorney with a bright future whose smile was radiant, saying he had an innate ability to connect with people. Guys, they are calling his death tragic, untimely, and suspicious. They say he was fluent in Spanish. They'd stayed at the resort before, and it's just not adding up for them. Oh, boy. Hope Definitely. they get some answers. Definitely tragic. Thank you, Janae. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.